Hey guys, welcome back to Bia's Healthy Life Corner. Your skin is the most sensitive and visible part of your body. The depletion of the ozone layer has increased the risk of skin damage from harmful UV rays of sun. Sunscreen blocks these rays, greatly reducing the likelihood of sunburn. In today's video, you will learn about reasons why we should apply sunscreen, what is SPF, how to choose a sunscreen for your skin type, how often do you need to put sunscreen on, and how much amount of sunscreen you need to purge up. The top 4 reasons to apply sunscreen are Number 1. It protects your skin from UV rays. Number 2. It prevents premature aging of skin. Number 3. It lowers your skin cancer risk. Number 4. It helps maintain an even skin tone. The most important question to ask is how do you choose a sunscreen for your skin type? So let me tell you in simple words that mainly there are two types of sunscreen. One is physical and one is chemical. And nowadays you can also get one with combination of two. Physical means you apply it and you run out of the house without waiting indoor to get the effect started. Whereas chemical means that you cannot leave immediately after application and you have to wait for at least 20 minutes before going out so that it start its work of helping your skin and protecting it from sun rays. So for oily skin type, look for the sunscreen with green tea or tea tree or silicones in it because they are not very greasy for the skin. For dry skin type, look for the sunscreen with ingredients like shea butter, rosehip oil, certain niacinamides if you want to brighten your skin. For sensitive skin type, look for the sunscreen that is hypoallergenic and is fragrance free and of course paraben free. Remember to look for the ingredients such as zinc oxide, titanium dioxide. Always do a little patch up test on your face to see if it suits your skin. Now what is SPF? SPF means skin protection factor. Let's say if I use SPF 30, that means that I can be out in sun 30 times longer before burning. Well, burning is a very heavy term. So if another person is using SPF 100, that does not mean he or she is protected 70 times more than the one using 30 SPF. But the difference is only 1-2%. to It's just the use of term. So as long as you use 30 SPF with plus 3-4 to four stars, it's totally good. How often do I need to put a sunscreen? Will any sunscreen last for only 2-3 to three hours and then you have to reapply it? Let's say you go to work and you are wearing makeup. You don't have to remove your makeup, but you can do two things. First, either get a makeup with SPF in it, then all you have to do is re-dab your combat. Or secondly, you can keep makeup setting spray that has SPF in it. So you just spray it on your face and that's it, you are good for another 2-3 to three hours. How much do I need to apply? Well, actually that question is really important. How much you have to apply on your face? At least you have to apply half a teaspoon of sunscreen and that is just the right amount to keep you protected from UV rays. If you think that your skin gets sticky, there are many sunscreens that are not sticky, so go for them. That's it. All you have to do is keep a proper sunscreen based on your skin type in your bag and you're always good to go. Another tip for you is that always remember to use sunscreen during winter as well because the harmful rays of sun has the power to come through clouds and damage your skin. That's all for today. Comment below to let me know what you think of it. Like, share and subscribe to my channel so that you can keep enjoying such informative videos. Take care.